So yo guys, welcome back to another video. Obviously it's been a while because currently we're in lockdown in the UK, but today we got a polo update video. The last polo video has actually been doing quite well. It's been gaining loads of views in like the last month has been like the most viewed video in like that time period. So a lot of people are interested in like polo update in the polo video, etc. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna give you, an but yeah, probably from the title of this video, you can tell we got some new wheels for this car. We're just about to pick them up. And yeah, I thought let me show you a little update because it's quite a big update with this car. So let's show you that. So if you've seen the last video, you will know uh, us doing the whole front, the whole lights. If you want to see that, make sure to go watch that video. These are the current wheels, but I want to show you the update. Yeah, as you can see, I've been hit in the back. And you see in the last video, we actually fixed this. And now it's come off again because we got hit in the back. The car is now a Cat N. So in America, it might be like salvage title, but Cat N in UK means uneconomical repair. So yeah, pretty much is a salvage title. So they wrote the car off, I bought it back from the insurance. And yeah, it pretty much just needs a new boot lid. Like as you can see from the bumper, there's not nothing much to the bumper. The bumper held pretty well, but you can see the boot lid is quite dented. So yeah, it doesn't shut quite well. It locks and everything, but obviously it's not flush. So we're gonna get a new boot lid and we're gonna fix the diffuser. The diffuser ordered new parts from Bolton Dynamics. A lot of you are asking where I got this diffuser from in the last video. His logo is there, but it's quite dirty. So yeah, the currently the wheels I got currently are the Bola B ones. Yeah, pretty much. I just bought these because they were local to me. Um, just a nice black one, local. I thought I just need black wheels because I hit I hit a curb in my other ones and broke those. I'll show you those now. So these were my first rims, the stock wheels on the car. Actually, some good alloy ones, but obviously not cool enough for me. But then these ones I bought cheap on Facebook Marketplace, 200 pounds. Some caliber ones, just some like cheap branded ones. But I smacked one of the wheels. Let's show you. <laughs> there you go. You can see I stacked it into a curb. So that's why I currently have what I have now. So you can see both of those are dented. And yeah, so these were like kind of temporary. I do like them, but I want to make, I wanted something a bit cooler than this because this is the same style as my last one. So yeah, we're going to get new rims. This is the current setup. Obviously a lot more needs to be done. I still haven't painted the front bumper um, and stuff like that. I haven't sorted the other dent. As you can see here, still have this dent over here. Um, so yeah, so new wheels today. This one's muddy for some reason. I just cleaned this car, but. So yeah, let's go and get some new wheels and show you our new wheels. We'll put them on the car, see how you like them. And I finally decided for the final update video, we're gonna lower the car. So make sure to subscribe here for the final update video. So it's a four hour drive to get these wheels. So let's go and grab them now. So boom, it's time to show you the new wheels. Just pick them up. These are actually so much nicer in person. All right, hold this, Murray. So these are Bola B17s. Obviously, I have B1s, but I saw these online on the Polo groups on Facebook, and I just had to get them. It was a really good price for what it is. These actually look epic. So what we're gonna do is, by the time we get home, it's gonna be probably dark. So we're gonna fit these tomorrow, and we'll show you how they look on the car. So yeah, we'll update you how these look on the car when we get back tomorrow. Boom, so back home now, and these, are the wheels B17s, look how sick they look. And we're gonna replace the B1s. And these B1s will be for sale. I know a lot of you guys kind of like these ones, so look at it. Obviously they're dirty, they are more glossy, but if you wanna buy these, DM me. Just put your Instagram into the, the comments and I'll DM you if you're interested, just let me know. Um, but yeah, we're gonna put these on. So boom, let's try and put these on now and just show you kind of how they look with these. Obviously the car's not finished, we need to do the bumper. So it's not gonna look top and we, like I said, I might lower it as you can see how high it is, it's worse in the back. So obviously stay tuned for the finale video that I was talking about in the last video. Obviously we had the car crash as well. So we need to fix the boot lid, everything. So even that bit here again. So boom, make sure to subscribe here if you're new and yeah, let's get these wheels on. So new wheels are on, as you can see how sick they look compared to the B1. Obviously there's like a style and aesthetic for these, which I'm not trying to go for. I do like these sort of style, but I don't think for this car it kind of suits it. I've always wanted like multi-spokes, but every time I look for wheels locally, that is all I can find, that sort of style. If you saw the Calibre ones earlier, they were similar style. Like I said, we drove four, five hours. I think it was a seven hour trip in total just to pick up these wheels. Um, but if you want to buy the B1s for cheap, they will be for sale, but 
yeah there's so much more like i said before we got to sort out the bumper we got to lower it we got to fix the dents spoiler still we got a spoiler and we got another polo we actually have three polos so make sure to subscribe to the channel if you love polos but yeah new rims let's get the rest on and we'll show you like a better look at them we'll clean the car and we'll show you a better look at them so for some reason the spigot that we will need to put it on our car does not fit on our new wheels whatsoever so i'm not sure obviously these ones they fit on these ones these came off these the first front one fits somehow but like we put them all the other ones they do not fit so we're gonna put the original wheels back on and then so i'll get in a spigot ring and yeah you can see it's a bit i'll cut myself and stuff trying to put these on so well trying to put the spigot on the wheel so um yeah we'll have to delay it for a few more days so we got the spigot and let's see if it fits oh that fits oh that's perfect so that's what you, we were missing before we had one of these this is the old one so this is 72.6 this is 73.1 millimeters you can see doesn't fit flush so we spent an hour trying to fit that in because i thought because we had the because the old wheels were bowler so i thought yeah all bowler wheels would be the same now we got all the spigots here we'll go put on all the wheels So the um, wheels are on and look at them, they look, they look proper. Obviously we got to sort out this gap and I'll probably be in the final video that I do of this car showing you once everything to fix, obviously dents and stuff, broken splitter. But obviously these are the old B1 wheels. As you can see, the B1s. I like the B ones just because they're purely because they stick out and stuff, but that looks better. So we're just shooting some pictures for AP London. See the Dubai plate C63. Todd, what are you saying? Give it a rev for the channel. If you want to buy a left hand drive with nice cars, go check out AP London up on the Instagram right here for you. Alright, hold on. Okay. So we have C63 polos over there. And yeah, let me go show you the polo new wheels. So boom, polo new wheels. This video is about the polo, of course, and yeah, pretty much having new wheels. I thought, let's churn out some content, obviously. If you've seen our previous video, you would have seen us fit the whole front end. I'll talk about that. I'll put the links in the description for the lights and everything um, in the last video if you want to go check that out. But yeah, Bola B17 wheels look so clean. They're finally on. Let's give you like a little walkthrough. He's coming over here. Jeez. All right, so boom. Obviously you got the dents, the finale video, I'm going to fix everything. I'm going to put some coilovers, going to fix the dents, fix the diffuser, put a spoiler, so much more stuff to, to put on this. Then we'll do a finale video walking through everything I bought for the car. So if you're going to stay tuned for that, make sure to subscribe. But yeah, I'll just give you a walk around. Obviously the car is dirty, we're in lockdown, car washes are closed. I'm not going to clean the car at minus one degrees. But yeah, as you can see, the wheels look sick. Obviously I just need to lower it just to give you that little more... Um, aggressive look to the car so yeah new wheels i thought i'd turn this out so guys i thought i'd turn this video out because i always see like vloggers doing um new wheel videos so new wheels for the polo last video got like 5,000 views in the space of like three months i was surprised for polo to get that many views so if you want to stay tuned for the finale video make sure to like make sure to subscribe and we will get a finale video uh, soon but yeah just quick vlog today and yeah guys i'll see you in the next polo video peace